welcome to another vlog. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So it is now a new week. It is Sunday. We are about to go to church. We're about to try this new church. A lot. It looks a lot like my old church from my hometown um, when I was doing my research. And so I just want to go and see what it's like, feel the vibes out and everything. Um, I'm pretty much in a rush, but this is the fit. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty much in a rush, but we're about to go ahead and go, me and King. And um, yeah, so... I'm gonna update y'all later and tell y'all how church went. I'm super excited. I hope it's good. They have a kids program just like my old church did, so he should be happy too. And yeah, so I'm pretty much rushing at this point. I'm gonna go ahead and go. Just okay. So I'm literally going to church. I ain't had no breakfast. King ate breakfast. King had breakfast, but I haven't ate. I haven't had no coffee or nothing. No. We're just gonna be filled with the word today. But yeah, I'm almost there, so. Okay, so we are about to leave church. Church was so good. So good? I like it. It's King approved. He like it. He said he like it better than our old church, which is wow. That's good. That's good, because this is our new church, so that's good. Um. But yeah, it was it was good. It really was good. It definitely does remind me a lot of my old church, which I already knew before I got here, because um, I, I I did my research. I looked on their Instagram. I looked on Google and everything. So I did my research and I saw that it's very similar in a lot of different ways to my old church. So, um, but it also has ways that it's different that I, I really actually like so um so yeah I'm really happy about it the message was good the message was actually about parenting which I needed to hear and I wish that his dad was here so he could have heard it too because it was a good message for parents it really was and um so yeah, I, I really thoroughly enjoyed it. I'm glad that we came. This is gonna be our new church home. It is. I wish I could have showed y'all some, but you know, this was the new introductory type of thing going on. So I didn't want to bring my phone in and just be recording stuff. So yeah, but so we're leaving church now. Um, and I'm excited to come here every Sunday. It was good. It was really good. Um, my hair is half curled, so that's why the curls is falling out. I was rushing, curling my hair this morning, but I'm about to stop by. Um, I don't know if I even want to go to Starbucks. Yeah, I think I should stop by Starbucks and then go home and get King ready because today he didn't know this, but today he is going with his gubbe. Yep. I'm supposed to go and meet his grandparents um, in Hattiesburg. It's halfway, an hour and a half away. Um, later on today, to take him to be with his grandparents. He's gonna be with them for like a week. Hey, I'm not going yet. You're going today. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I'm taking him today to go be with his uh, grandparents. They're gonna meet me halfway. They stay three hours away. We're gonna meet in the middle. So, so yeah, you hear him. He's gonna be happy. So that's what we can ready to do, which is cool because it gives me a chance for this week to go ahead. I love you too, baby. It gives me a chance this week to go ahead and um, get back in the gym and just start handling more business like I need to. So I'm cool with it. It's a nice little break. And yeah, so Starbucks first. Good morning, y'all. It's the next day. Um, it's Monday, so King is not with me. Um, I met his grandparents halfway to get him yesterday, so it's a free day. It's a free week, and I'm about to. Oh. If you're wondering what's on my face, <laughs> I'm narrowing my um, eyebrows. Well, actually, V. I'm using V. I don't have nair right now. I'm um, just trying to get myself together a little bit. But, yeah, um, I'm about to go get some coffee. I'm going back to Bright Eyed Brew Coffee Co. 
um, because I got a free coffee waiting on me up there. So that's where I'm going. And um, then after that, I have to go to my parcel. We got parcel pending here. I just think that that's so convenient. Where like if you get a package, they put it in a parcel for your parcel locker and you put in a code and get your package. Like that's just so fancy and cute. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go get that. Um, my broom, I ordered a pink broom and this pan off of Amazon. It's so cute. I can't wait to go get it on my locker. And then after that, I'm going to the gym. So I get to show, I get to finally show y'all the gym. I'm so excited. Here's the fit. Ignore the clothes back there. Those are not dirty. Those are clothes that I am having to put up. I got so many clothes oh my gosh like anyway yeah so i'm about to do that i'm just so excited i can be back in the gym they got a peloton y'all so i'm i don't know i'm just gonna ease back into it i ain't gonna take myself too too hard too fast none of that but yeah so i'm gonna watch this off in a minute hopefully it did something for me because i've been doing my own brows like this is What's the point of paying twelve, fifteen dollars to get your eyebrows done when you can do them yourself? So hopefully they come out right this time because I haven't done them in like weeks. Well, yeah. Okay, y'all, made it to the gym. First day back at the gym. Let me give y'all a little tour right quick. So you know, this is my apartment's gym. So give y'all a little tour. We got a stairmaster now, Pooh. Um, they got the, I don't know what that's called, but they got the two, a treadmill, and then what I'm really excited about trying, the Peloton. I'm so excited. Like, you know, the balls and stuff, stretchy stuff, weights, and so yeah, this is definitely enough for me. Like, I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so happy to be back in the gym. Like, I just, I'm just so happy. And then, this is touch screen too. Like, this is so cool. But yeah, I touched the screen to get to what I was doing. It's so cool, I'm gonna show y'all. Safe to say, I, I did myself today, bro for my first day back. The sweat. Okay guys, so I'm back home. Um, What I got from Audi was just some stuff to make tuna with. As you can see, I still got some stuff on the counter. Um, So yeah, I made some tuna. Shout out to Serenity, cause she the one that made me want some. But um, I'm finna, I'm about to open my broom. And dustpan. I'm about to open my room and dustpan from Amazon. Um, it's paint, of course, period. It's called a luxurious broom and dustpan set. <laughs> That's so on brand, period, period, period. Y'all, <laughs> this is so me. Oh my gosh, bro. This is so cute. Now when I sweep, it'll be pretty. Y'all, cause I don't know if I told y'all, but when I moved, I don't know how, my broom and dustpan got left behind, but I'm kind of glad it did cause it was old and halfway broken really. And it was blue, it just wasn't cute. Like, it was the type of broom and dustpan, if it was out in the background of a video, I would literally, mm, like, move it, because it was ugly. So I gotta put this together. Here go the dustpan. It's so cute, so cute, so cute. Yeah, so I got instructions to read and stuff. Um, Hold on, because I know y'all don't care about me putting together broom and dustpan. I'm gonna come back when I'm done. Okay. I'm, this is a short broom for thirty dollars, Amazon. What the? F nah, baby. No, 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 no. Oh, I was gonna say. So that's what I get when I read the instructions all the way. Cause it's supposed to be three on the broom and then two on 
the dustpan. I'm like, hold up. Hold up, big baby. That's what I said. That's not it. Bro, I'm confused. Okay, so this go like this. And then, okay, 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 okay. Bit, 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 bit. Wait, is this right? Is this the same length that it just was? No, it's longer. Girl, child, child, child. Okay, so here got a room, period. Okay, I said period, but this is still short as fuck. Come on. Yeah. This broom is short. Fuck. This can't be it. It gotta be another piece to go in here. Uh-uh, I ain't settling for that. <clears throat> okay, so. Oh, it is another piece. Girl, am I? What's wrong with me? Okay, now, now we got a broom. Now we got a broom, period. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I like it, I like it. Okay, and then the dustpan just needs <clears throat> this part. This part. And then this part. Yeah. Y'all cannot say this is not super cute. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. Bitch. I'm finna be. Hold on, let me move the camera because I got a pile of trash that has just been sitting here because I ain't had no broom. So uh, let me adjust the camera. Cause baby, we finna sweep. Period. I gotta get a hot glue gun to fix that. Don't even, it's coming. I gotta get a hot glue gun to fix it. That's something else that was left in my old apartment. My hot glue gun, I had one cause I was making hat wigs. Anyway, so cute. I got a pile of trash right here. Oh, and then I don't have to hold the dustpan. Like I had to hold my old dustpan cause it wasn't as sturdy. Probably because I got some dollar general, but this is so cute. Oh my god. I, I love this. This is so pretty. Okay, I know y'all don't care about my broken dustpan. I just wanted to show y'all because it's so cute. Okay, good morning, y'all. I am um it's like I think the last time we talked was Monday. Today is Wednesday. I am about to try a new coffee shop. It's over here by the hair store. The hair store is like 20, 30 minutes away from my house. So I was looking for a local owned coffee shop in the area and I found one and it's really cute. I'm sitting outside of it now, but yeah. <laughs> um, gonna get some coffee first and then I'm gonna go to the hair store and then back home, go to the gym and um then wait on my packages to come because my hair is supposed to be coming in today and i got another um piece of wallpaper coming in today so finally get to do something that's why i didn't vlog yesterday because i'm like i ain't got nothing to do like i'm looking at the drive through it's um that drive through is gonna stand still bookie poker roots all right, but yeah, I'm gonna go in here. I'm gonna show y'all. It's so cute. My, my tan is crazy. I really got tan. Oh, it is. Okay, y'all. So, review time of the coffee. Honestly, it's really pretty in there. They are really nice, and this coffee is really good. I wish I had one closer to my house. But, um, yeah, it's good, and it's so cute. Look at this. I like it. It's a um, restaurant, too. Like, they serve food. But I, ain't, I can't. I'm, I'm on my... Um, I'm back on my healthy journeys. It's over with for it. But, yeah they were really nice in there 
and um now i just have to wait on the hair store to open so i would have stayed in there but the temptation to get some food was too high so i came back out here in my car i'm just gonna go and park in front of the hair store at this point and wait Woo! it's good though i like it and then like down here they be having stuff like that but i'm just Okay, y'all, so I, I'm i leaving the hair store. Um, I just met a girl in there who works there. I just met a girl that works at the hair store that I just went to. Um, she does hair down here. Um, I'm gonna tag, I'm gonna put her name on the screen, her, face, her name on Facebook. We add each other as friends. And um, she let me put my business cards in there. So that's, that's what y'all just saw was me showing y'all my business cards showing my business cards in there so yeah we making connections around the city period but um yeah so i went to that hair store because it's cheaper than the one that i went to last time and um we all about saving coins but yeah i'm about to head home now the hair still isn't delivered so it gives me the perfect opportunity to go ahead and go to the gym and then um i really need to go to the store though Honestly, I need to go get something to cook. And see, I was just by the grocery store. I should have gotten it then. So, now nah, I'm not going home yet. I'm actually about to go get something to cook today. I'm feeling like a salmon bowl is the answer to my problems today. Since I can't figure out what I want to eat. So, why are they going so slow? So, yeah, I'm about to go to the store and get me the ingredients to make a salmon bowl. I really want a jerk salmon bowl, but we just gonna see, cause yeah. Okay guys, I'm back home. I got a real good sweat in today, honey. Feeling real good. Sorry, I didn't record when I was in the gym cause it was actually people in there. So that kind of messed it up for me recording. Cause I, you know, it's awkward, especially if you in like a, um, a smaller gym, it's kind of awkward just having your camera out you know so but i just got done cooking and the only reason why i thought about cooking in front of y'all but i was like man i'm hungry that's gonna take more time and i got a lot to do today but i finally finally i haven't had a salmon bowl in weeks literally and basically a salmon bowl is just um salmon with rice and um bell peppers and broccoli and I um, I call it jerk salmon because I put jerk seasoning on it. So that's really the only difference between a regular salmon bowl and a jerk salmon bowl is the fact that I put jerk seasoning on it. Just to give it a little more oomph, a little more flavor, a little more something to look forward to. And then the sauce is the sriracha mayo sauce. And I put soy sauce in it too. So I got this recipe just the salmon bowl recipe in general. I got it from a, a cooking page on Instagram. It's cooking with Asia. Um, when I first started my fitness journey, someone sent me her page and said that she had good recipes on there. So I got it from her. And then the jerk seasoning, I got it from my, um, my client turned friend, Veronica. She put me on to the jerk salmon thing. Although I knew it was a thing, it just wasn't in my head as like, you should do that for your food. Until I saw her do it, I was like, oh yeah. Anything to add some flavor pool. So. Mm. It hits every time. Now I will say, if you're not a fan of spice, then you may not want the jerk um, season because it does, it is spicy as jerk, but Okay, so in other news, more wallpaper is in, period. I'm gonna show y'all me putting it up. And then the hair came in, so after I put the wall up, I can do a little content with me, you know, with showing the bundles and stuff like that. Because I got kinky, curly, and then I got deep wave, and I can show people the difference between the deep wave and the kinky curly hair. So yeah, but that's really it. 
So I'm gonna put this wallpaper up as soon as I get done eating. But before I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and start bleaching the knots on these closures. So they can be good and ready when I get done putting the wall up, I'm gonna get started working. So, okay y'all, the time has come. I'm about to put an, add another section on to my wall over here so I don't have to be just squished up in this corner. Because honestly, it was never in my plans to have this white wall as a part of my background. Good thing it eats, but I really want this whole wall to be pink. So we just gonna take it one step at a time with this wallpaper. When I tell y'all, this is not easy. I took, when I first did it the first time, I took this off and put it back on so many times. It wasn't, it wasn't easy. So this time I gotta be real careful because I don't wanna mess it up, but. Okay, so this is the bottom. We're gonna have to Move this around. I just feel so good. I'm back eating the food that I love. I'm back doing the things that I love in a, a better environment. Like, I'm just so happy. God knew I needed it. He knew. Okay. So, we're going to line it up with the top up here. I get scared every time I do this. I'm not scared, but like, there's a good chance that I could mess up and I would have to redo it. And I just don't, and it is loud too. Like when you have to take it off and put it on and take it off and put it on. And it's just so easy to mess up. Like peeling and stick wallpaper is not to be played with. It's not, it's really not. Shit. Hold on, I'm, I'm, hold on. <laughs> okay, we're getting somewhere. Sorry, I had to do this off camera because I know I would struggle and it would take them a lot of time and space. see now I'm irritated because all right <clears throat> so as you can see I started at the same exact point very very much even like it's very even so they really ripped me off because why does wallpaper stop right here what am I gonna do with this like, um, and I, I, I ordered the same exact kind that I had before. So that's why I'm irritated because I ordered the same measurement, same length, paid the same price as I did for this one. But this one is shorter. What the fuck? And I have finally had it like lined up right, but I can't have this part of the wall just showing like, I can't. That's tacky as fuck. So now, what I'm gonna have to do in the meantime, cause I, I just messaged the seller. So now what I'm gonna have to do in the meantime is take it back off the wall, even though I did it so good, it would have been so good if it was everything that it was supposed to be. I'm gonna have to take it back off the wall and bring it down some, which is gonna have it like uneven up here. Cause I'm gonna have to bring it down to about like right here maybe. For that, they should just give me a whole free one. I mean, I'm confused. This is crazy. Like, they really got over, and I'm really irritated by this because this could have been a one and done type of thing, and then I wouldn't need no more but two more to finish the wild to like put something up here and then put another little piece right over there in the corner. But now it has to be uneven, which is gonna look a freaking mess. Like, I'm so irritated. Cause what was the point in me ordering the same exact thing just for it to be way freaking shorter? Okay, 
I'm about to take it back down and reposition it, and it's just gonna be crooked, which pisses me the fuck off, honestly. It pisses me off. But anyway, let me just go ahead and do it. Okay, so just for context, this is how much they ripped me off. You see the difference? Matter of fact, let me back up a little bit so I can show y'all. Like, I already have to complete the rest of this wall, literally. If this was up here where it's supposed to be, everything would be fine, right? Because then I would be able to just focus on that and up there. But now I have to, I message the seller, because they're going to have to send me, like, excuse me, how you just going to rip me off like that? And I told y'all, this wallpaper is not cheap. This wallpaper was like $60. Both of these were the same. I just reordered it. I didn't, think, I didn't get nothing different. I just reordered it. So yeah, I'm kind of irritated because this affects my content. And I would rather it go all the way to the floor than it, you know, be up there leveled up and then the floor, half the floor is showing. So I just had to do it like that, but I'm honestly irritated. Like, so now I have to bring my camera down to an even lower angle because of this. Like, I'm so irritated. Like, I just don't. Ain't nothing I can do about it right now, child. I'm just, the fuck? Okay, so update, update. Let me tell y'all how God works. So, um, let me tell y'all how God works. So, I said something to the seller, obviously. And, um, they said that, you know, they aim for customer satisfaction. So what they're gonna do is they can either send me a whole another one like the first one um, for free, no charge at all, or they can send me enough to fill up my whole wall for free and I pay the $35 shipping fee. I tell y'all gotta be working because I would show like it's gonna take me a long time to fill this wall up and it's expensive to buy this wallpaper. So, you mean to tell me I could fill this whole wall up for $35? Because I showed and I already spent like $120 on just these two. So, wow. Everything do happen for a reason, you see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? So, now we're going to speed this process up. And um, she also said that the, one, the wallpaper that she sent me to fill up the whole wall is going to be a continuation of each other. So, it'll blend more. Because you see how, like, you can kind of tell that it's the same wallpaper repeated, just shorter. It's the same exact print. So it kind of looks like print, print instead of going together as one wall. So she sent me that, we're good to go. I'm happy, I'm really happy about that. So like I said, you see what I mean? I live by everything happens for a reason because I was gonna be frustrated about this, but God already had it worked out. Like, let me save you some money, baby. Period. Okay, so we good to go. This is good enough for right now. So now I can get to work and still shoot content. Ain't nobody gonna know. But y'all, ain't nobody gonna know that this wall is not finished yet. I mean, that people already know it's not finished though. They already know that because I posted it all over social media that it wasn't finished yet. So ain't nobody really, I'm just happy because I get to complete my wall. If I go ahead and pay the $35 shipping fee today, then I go ahead and get, I'm done. You know what I'm saying? I'm done paying for the wall. And they can just go ahead and now my wall is done. Now my wall is complete, period. All right, now I'm finna get to work. So, see how everything just works out? Even when you think something is not working out, it's still working out. But that's what happens when you have a relationship with God and you have your faith in God, period. Don't ask me why I go so hard for Jesus. Don't ask me why. Living testimony, period. Okay guys, I just got done making this kinky curly wig and now I have to um, pluck it and style it. Um, and after I do that, that's really it for work today. You see the bundles behind me. I um, I don't have all the supplies I need to keep going, but it's okay because honestly, it's like four o'clock at this point. 
and I'm just, I'm just, I'm just done. I'm just done after this. Like, I just want to soak in a tub. I'm tired. We got a head start, fresh start tomorrow. Um, work to do. I got to go back to the hair store because I don't have everything I need to do what I need to do. So, yeah. But, um, yeah, so I'm about to plug and style this week. It's really giving, like, Megan the Stallion. How have you been lately? Hi, right, guys. So, done with this client's week. And what I'm doing now is just, like, even though it's just a client's week, it's on a new background from what my old back, uh, from what my old background was. So what I'm really just trying to do is, anytime I finish a wig and it slays and it's you know all of them slay. Anytime I finish a wig, whether it's a client's wig or not, I'm gonna post it on the website just to replace the old picture. Even if it's nothing wrong with the old picture, just because I want everything to be like on one of them. That's where we at. So cute. Okay, guys, so I just got home. Anyway, I'm excited because this wig that I just finished this morning is a client's wig. Not just any client's wig, but my first client since I moved to Biloxi. We actually stay in the same complex. And the day that I moved here, um, you know how you post the key. I posted the key and stuff and it was like, you know, there's a new wig maker in town. And she been following me. She from Jackson too, but she been staying here for a few years. And she was like, that's like my apartment. And I was like, what? No way, where you staying? And then we just went from there. So she stays a few buildings down, actually. So it's my first local pickup order. And it's so cute. Look at the curls though, babe. Look, too freaking cute. I'm so excited. I cannot wait. And she's buying some curl cream for me. I really need to order more products because it's only one left after I sell this one. But she's buying curl cream to make the curls pop. So yeah, I'm just so freaking excited. Like this is my first. Let me give y'all a better look. Like, hello, she eats. Those curls are beautiful, fluffy, soft, so pretty. She eats, like literally. I'm so excited. Period. All stocked and ready to go. I'm so happy. Hey guys. Oh, hey guys. Today is Saturday, and um, I have I don't know I'm um actually getting ready to go and get some hibachi. I've been craving hibachi, so I'm finally gonna go get some. Um. I'm in my, this is my chill attire. It ain't nothing special. I know it's a Saturday and everybody outside, but baby, I've been cleaning up all morning. And um, I'm just, I'm just going to get something to eat. So yeah, I'm gonna go get some hibachi. And then I also need to, it looks like the hibachi place is um, in the same area as Target. So I need to stop by Target. This will be my first time going to the Target out here. So, yeah, I just need to stop by Target and get a couple things. Hopefully, we don't spend a lot of money because you already know how Target will get you. Target will get you. So... Option one. It's 
just okay. I like it though, but it's just this that mm. see I really need to start getting my guest bathroom together. This is cute. This is really cute. I'm about to come back for that. Oh, and I love this. This is too pretty. Oh, I might get this now. Hello. This is so cute. Okay, so I definitely didn't come in here for this, but these bath rugs are cute. I'm gonna have to come back for one of these when I'm ready to do the bathroom in full. But I did get this though. This is so cute. I don't even need a lamp, but these lamps are too cute. They're so freaking pretty. Oh, wow. If I needed one, I would get one. But I actually don't need any lamps at the moment. Oh, these are pretty. What? Like, what? These lamps, though? They're too freaking pretty. I wish I had somewhere to put them, but I don't. <sighs> but could this pass for, like, a dirty clothes hamper? Because if so, this is so cute. Okay, y'all, so I just got home. I just ate, so um, I had to eat first. The hibachi was good. It was real good. Or, you know, I was just real hungry, but, you know, the hibachi was good. So let me show y'all what I got from Target, from Target. Let me back this camera up. Okay, I'm sitting on the floor. But I needed another laundry basket because when I moved, well, let me let me go inside first. So first, I got this um, I guess Target brand hand soap. It's uh with milk and honey. It smells good, and I got it because um I needed some more soap for my soap dispensers, and I got one in my bathroom, but I got this cute soap dispenser it's so aesthetic and just like pretty i got this soap dispenser for my um uh guest bathroom for whenever i have company over i also got some mouthwash i needed some ran out of that and then i don't know well i know how this top came off but i got some more deodorant it's because i took the top off to smell it in the store and I guess I didn't put it back on good enough. But anyway, yeah, I just got some secret pH balance shower fresh um, deodorant. I got that because it was the cheapest one. Y'all know it's hard to be high. And then I got some more Dr. Teal's bubble bath and um, some Dove soap, the two bars. And um, I got these two toothbrushes because they was pink and they was a dollar. And I was thinking like, I do need another toothbrush. So I got it, and then I got this um, cute, aesthetically pleasing dirty clothes hamper. It took everything in me to not get one of those forty, thirty dollar ones that was just so cute that I was showing y'all. But I thought, like you know, if you're gonna get a ten dollar clothes hamper, you're gonna go cheaper. You might as well get the cutest one they got. So instead of getting the the plastic one with the holes in it, they can easily rip up because that's where I got my last one from. And you see, I don't have it today, and I don't even think I had that one for like a year. I got this one instead. It's so cute. And um, I think it's gonna go cute in my guest bathroom with this. So I don't know. I know dirty clothes hampers don't go in the bathroom, but for now, they it can go in there until I get it together. Cause these are literally the only two decorative things I have to go in anywhere. So I'm just so excited. But yeah, right now I'm finna, um, King is coming home today. So I wanna have the house clean. So I'm gonna do the dishes and clean up in the front more. Oh, I got some ice cream too. And then I need to clean up my room. You know, you can't go to Target without getting something that TikTok made you buy. TikTok made me buy this. I know, I know, I know. But it's it looked like it's gonna be good. So I'm gonna try it. Cause I'll be having a sweet tooth and I don't be having nothing sweet to eat. So now I got something sweet to eat, period. But y'all finna clean up and stuff. I'm just so excited. I'm gonna show, show y'all. Let's go put this soap dispenser in the bathroom because I'm just too thirsty to do that. Let's go see how it look. 
Okay, y'all, we in the bathroom. It is not, like, when I say it's nothing going on in here, like, nothing. That's a towel that needs to be washed. But, like, other than that, King, I'm going to get him for that. Because I don't even come in this bathroom. It just shows I do not come in here. Yeah, anyway, so I already put the soap in here. And, um, see, I just think it goes perfectly with, like, the whole... How like the the whole thing, the whole vibe, like just wait. I gotta clean because obviously this is but like look at it. That is too cute. That's so freaking cute. And just imagine like I had the towels to match and I have like the little rug right here with this. And then I wanna have like some pompous grass, maybe like right there. It's gonna be cute. It's gonna come together real cute. Okay, so we're gonna take the dirty clothes hamper and we're gonna slide it right here where it belongs. So that way it won't be like invading the, the space. But like, you see where I'm going with this though? Like this is gonna be so cute when I get it all together. But I don't know, I just feel like it's such a vibe. Like that is so aesthetically cute. So cute, so cute, so cute. Okay guys, so that pretty much sums up my um it, that pretty much sums up this week's vlog as you can see i have a mess behind me to work with and to clean up so i'm gonna go ahead and end it here but thank y'all so much for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and also y'all know i want to do next for next week's video instead of doing a vlog i really want to do like a sit down chit chat um you know girls talk you know so whatever y'all want to talk about whatever you want to know got any questions or anything any topics you want to discuss let me know so we can do this we can get us a glass of wine and sit down and talk you know what i'm saying anything y'all want to know about me i'm here to talk about basically so yeah but don't judge me for the mess i'm gonna get right on it we're gonna get this thing cleaned up i'm gonna see y'all on next week's video if you got any ideas comment or Hit me up. Let me know what ideas you got for next week's video. Thanks, y'all. Love y'all. Bye.